90 Day. The last resort has lost its popularity among 90 Day Fiancé viewers due to several problematic things going on during the therapy retreat. Hello everyone, welcome to my channel, please subscribe and keep watching for more details 90 Day. The last resort was very popular initially but lost its charm after a few episodes. The new 90 Day Fiancé spin-off got much attention because of its concept. The show featured various pairs moving into a seaside resort, trying to resolve their respective problems through therapy. 90 Day The last resort proposed a brand new idea and generated a lot of excitement. It promised a lot of drama and delivered. The new series also hooked fans because it only showed well-known cast members and didn't cast anyone new. Asuli Pula and Kaleni Fagata had one of the strangest journeys on 90 Day, the last resort. The pair should have divorced when they mutually cheated on each other, but they still joined the show to air their dirty laundry. The two exposed each other's worst sides and revealed hidden details many 90 Day Fianchi fans didn't know. Similarly, Molly Hopkins and Kelly Brown had an explosive run that ended badly. The two couldn't look each other in the eyes due to their differences and hatred. Despite that, they tried to make things work, knowing they didn't have a future 90 day. The last resort's popularity skyrocketed in the beginning. The first few episodes featured numerous bombshell reveals that greatly entertained many viewers. The show seemed full of drama, from Kalani sharing Asulu's cheating scandal in great detail to Yara Zaya opening up about hiding a big secret from Jovi Dufren. Unfortunately, things just toned down after the pairs began undergoing the therapy sessions. Per a Reddit thread, Oak Cauliflower 739, the show has become more like a melodrama than reality TV. Since 90 Day, the last resort was only filmed for two weeks. It didn't offer good storyline progression like other 90 Day Fiancé spin-offs. Like most spin-offs, 90 Day. The last resort had the chance to stand out and be more immersive. While the show initially impressed fans with new revelations, it eventually became tiresome. Many viewers got bored to see cast members getting emotional about everything. A few of the nonsensical moments include when Yara lashed out at Jovi for trying to wake her up at night. Angela Dean cursing at Liz Woods, and Big Ed splashing Kelly in the hot tub. The cast members' emotions sometimes felt forced and fake, which soured the show for many viewers. Another thing that eventually became tiring was the drama and repetitiveness. Most 90 Day Fianca shows are flavorful because of the variety. They feature varied cast members from different parts of the world, unique locations, and much more. In comparison, 90 Day. The last resort featured the same seaside resort setting, similar setups, and the same old drama. The show heavily relied on the cast members to have a great time during the therapies. Instead, many 90 Day. The last resort viewers just got tired of seeing the same old couples dealing with a predictable drama. 